Welcome to Solve, the virtual lab at NITK. In this short tutorial, I will explain you how to use this interface to do the acceleration analysis of slider crank mechanism. As you have seen in the other simulations, this interface mainly consists of three sections. One for the animations, second one for changing the variables, and third one for control. In the animation section, you have scaled position, velocity and acceleration diagrams which are dynamic to the values you change. By moving the slider, you can vary the radius, length and angular velocity of the crank. And corresponding changes can be seen in this animation and the table. If you want to change the angle to analyze various positions of the crank mechanism, pause the animation by clicking here in controls and then change the angle here. Once you set it up for the required angle theta r, corresponding acceleration diagram can be found here. Press play to see and analyze changing acceleration of the slider crank mechanism. Thank you for watching this tutorial.